My name's David Black. I'm the co-founder and head brewer at the Coastal Brewing Company. The Coastal Brewing Company is based in Foster, New South Wales, Australia. Foster is a lovely seaside town that's about three and a half hours north of Sydney. We're a family owned and operated microbrewery producing a range of ales and lagers. Our focus at the Coastal Brewing Company is all about brewing beers that people want to drink. It's about looking after our customers and looking after the environment. My wife and I started the brewery in mid-2017 and we produce keg beer which we sell into venues, pubs and clubs. We also can our beer on site here at the brewery which we sell both through the tasting room and to retail outlets. At the brewery it's all about life. That's local, independent, fresh every time. As anybody in the brewing industry knows, there's a lot more to making beer than just brewing. One of the major considerations is the waste that's generated through the process, in particular the quantity of wastewater that's generated. This wastewater as well as being significant quantity, also has characteristics of being high in nutrients and high in biological oxygen demand. Biological oxygen demand, BOD, if it gets into waterways untreated, can rob other organisms of the oxygen that they need to live. In order to meet local regulations, we needed to reduce the BOD in our wastewater to below 600 milligrams per litre, and ideally to below 300 milligrams per litre, otherwise we'd suffer significant financial penalties. To reduce our BOD, we now have two biogel towers on site treating our wastewater. The wastewater first passes through initial settling and a screening process to remove larger particles such as grain and fibre from the hops. The wastewater then moves into an equalisation tank where we correct the pH to be in the range 7 to 9. After the pH has been equalised on the water, it's pumped to the first biogel tower. There the wastewater recirculates before passing into the next biogel tower for additional treatment. After treatment through the towers, the water then goes to a discharge tank before it's discharged into the sewer. This is important because part of our regulations is that we can only discharge at certain times a day. In our case, overnight, when the demand on the sewer system is low. The biogel towers have been great. They've been easy to maintain, produce minimal odour, and are helping us achieve the results that we need in that we're compliant with our requirements and we're not incurring any surcharges. Another great advantage of the Biogill Towers is that as our production grows and we have more waste water, we can simply add more towers to the process. As a brewer, I know the importance of sustainable brewing practices and protecting the beautiful environment in which we live. I'm proud of the fact that we're taking responsibility for our wastewater and treating our wastewater on site.